All right, good day, good way, family. It's 10 9. I'm not one of them Molly, you in danger types, but today is a somewhat dangerous day if you ain't careful. Just being real with you. It's a 10 9 in a three year. That 10 is your wholeness, that 9 is your highest vibration, but it's also what's controlling you. That 3, it's how you're communicating with life. Are you creating something? Are you destroying something? What, what are we making? So here we go. We're going to do a little series. So we're going to start with the 10, which is, you know, dealing with the month, but it's the wholeness of you. What I got was the 14 in reverse. The 14 is the temperance card. This is an urgency. This is where I done been through a little bit too much and I don't like who I am or I don't know who I am and I don't know what I'm creating. This is an almost straight up this too much card. In the sense of this urgency, it's holy shit. Life ain't really, life ain't been real. Now I'm trying to find out what reality is, but I don't know what's an illusion. And then that takes you over to the nine, which is today. Nine, the highest vibration, as high as you can count, but it's also as low as you can go if you're under control. And what we got was the two in reverse, the high priestess. It's fear. It's the fear of the unknown. For a lot of us, the fear of the unknown it was, is what keeps us going back to what's known. Knowing that what's known is what's known to fuck you over. You gotta do something different. You gotta embrace change. It's the only motherfucking constant in this universe. Two thousand nineteen is a twelve. It's a twelve before it gets to the three. So we got to deal with the twelve first. The twelve is the hangman's energy. The twelve is discipline. So what we got in the sense of discipline is justice in reverse. It's an eleven in reverse. That eleven to get you all kinds of done up. It is the wrongdoing. It is the Linda, Linda, Linda. We've been too busy out here justifying how to keep doing what's the got us done up that we don't know what the fuck we doing no more. Linda, Linda, Linda. Taking the three previous cards, the 10, the 9, and the 12, you can turn that into a 22. The 22 is your spiritual journey. The 22 is your path. What you have to understand is the current path that most of us is on is the world in reverse. And look at the world today. That motherfucker's upside down. So when your world's upside down, it makes you pay more attention to the shit that make you cry this too much than the shit you should be rejoicing about. Life is motherfucking good. Live it. But remember, I told you that 12 becomes a three. This year, 2019, is also a year of a three, which is a year of creation based off of your communication, but it's also destruction based off of your communication. And guess what we got? We got the three card. We got Oshun herself, my fair fool Oshun. Come here, girl. Let me taste that, honey. Mm, wow, delicious. Communication, 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 communication. The most important thing you need to understand right now is reciprocity. Let a motherfucker show you what's true. Now, using that formula of a 10, a 9, and a 3, you can get a 13. 13 is a death card. That's why I put my death dealer hat on. Oh, I love death dealers. Delicious. And guess who came up? My boss. My fair fool nephew. Got the trickster himself. Got the fool card in reverse. Ignorance. You ignoring shit. Shit showing you was real. Oh, she showed you was real, but it ain't what you wanted to see. So you keep fooling yourself. So whether you went the uh, 10, 9, 12 route or you went the 10, 9, 3 route, either way it go, it led you to a 4. That 22 led you to a 4, that 13 led you to a 4, and that 4 is the sun card. It's rebirth. Rebirth ain't a good thing. That word re means to bring back. So you're just going to keep doing this dance over and over again, looking for a different answer, using the same things, doing the same old things. Do something different, motherfuckers. So to bring that all home, realistically, uh, the, the, the best advice I got for you today is the strength card. It's the eight. You got to know that you are already your abundance. Everything that you're seeking to achieve, everything that you're seeking to do in life is already laced inside of you. You just got to apply yourself or in some cases realize that where you have already applied yourself too much and now you are the situation. Reciprocity, people. Resonance and reciprocity.